Hello Cancers, so this is your weekly reading. I'm going to start it um, with the tarot for the 11th until the 18th. Let's see what's going on. Okay, so Universe, what's the current energy between Cancers and the person that's on Cancer Mind for February 11th to the 18th, 2022? A lot of cards, Ace of Pentacles, Three of Wands, um, six of pentacles six of swords okay so i see you guys moving forward on to better things okay some of you guys are dealing with the taurus a virgo let's see what else i'm getting universe the person that's on cancer mind would like to say to cancer eight of wands in reverse okay this is an x then what they like to say right now they don't want to say anything they're quiet let's see what else i'm getting universe the person that's on cancer mind why are they keeping hidden from cancer king of wands okay so if you have someone new i feel like your ex know of that person like not know of that person but they know that you have moved on with someone new okay let's see what else i'm getting universe the person that's on cancer in mind how do they feel about cancer four swords eight of pentacles nine of wands i feel like this person in a cross road type of energy they don't know should they reach out or not i feel like right now they're just being quiet they're just watching you let me see what else i'm getting Universe, the person that's on Cancer Mind, what is their true feelings for Cancer? Universe, the person that's on Cancer Mind, what is their true feelings for Cancer? Knight of Swords, yeah, they really want to speak. So even though they're not talking to you, like, they really want to speak. Universe, the person that's on Cancer Mind, what is their intentions with Cancer? Hierophant be in a relationship with you again. I feel like this is more so with someone that's new. Taurus, you guys are doing Taurus or... A Virgo. Um, the new person really want things to move forward with you. They definitely see you as a wife, as a husband. They really want to move forward with you. It's what else I'm getting. Universe, the person that's on Cancer Mind, what actions will they take with Cancer? Tower. Okay. Five of Pentacles. Let's clarify the Tower. Universe, clarify the Tower. Universe. Nine of Cups. Will of Fortune, beautiful. So I feel like your Valentine's Day is gonna be really nice. Um, it's gonna be really nice. I feel like there's gonna be nice surprises for you. Um, if you're connecting with someone, if you're single, you're gonna be treating yourself well, okay? Um, but there's gonna be a nice surprise during this week. Now, at the same time, even though they're, you guys probably haven't talked for a long time with this ex person, I feel like this ex is gonna reappear soon. Probably nine days from now, not exactly this week. So I do see that, but I see things are getting better. I feel like if you guys are focusing on someone new, I feel like this connection is really good. They have a lot of potential. This person definitely see your worth. Okay, let me clarify this. Universe cut by the King of Wands. Universe cut by the King of Wands. The Moon. Yeah, so this is just them knowing that there's someone else in the picture, the ex. Okay. They're just, yeah, so this is someone who's been quiet for a while, but I feel like they are going to reach out again. Not probably this week. They can reach out this week, but I feel like it's probably a little later, okay? But I do see you have a beautiful thing with someone else, okay? Or this could just be with you. You have a beautiful relationship with yourself. So the sign, okay? The X could be a Gemini Sagittarius. Okay, the new person could be a Taurus or a Virgo. Okay, there's some Scorpio and Pisces energy too. Okay, click here. Okay, Universe, then we have four cards, but what's going to happen in Cancer's love life? So this is the face off card. Mirror effect. The universe giving two more cards. What's going to happen? Acceptance and error. And Aries. Okay, so we're going to deal with the Aries. However, I feel like they will be communicating this X. However, I feel like you guys accepted the fact that like you guys are just not meant to be. And you're going to move forward and date other people. Because air is a very, I'm thinking about Libra. Libra is a very charming, sociable and attractive sign. So 
So I feel like you guys are just going to open your options up, okay? Date, if you're in a relationship right now, you are feeling this connection. You're not caught up with the ex. So you see what else I'm getting. Okay, universe, give me a three card spread. What messages do you have for cancer? Freedom. Acceptance again and <laughs> judgment. Look at that. So I feel like you guys accept the fact that you guys are just not meant to be. You are moving forward. You're done caring about the situation. Okay. Let's see what they would like to say. All right, universe, give me a three cards for the person that's on cancer mind. We like to say to cancer. Okay, so this ex, what they like to say, they have let in go this connection, but not really. <laughs> they let it go, but there's indecision, okay? Um, this is someone who was probably playing a lot of games. There was, um, there was making things seem like an illusion, okay? Um, this is someone who didn't really know what they want, to be honest, I would say, here. There's someone who don't know what they want, but it's like they're trying to let go, but not really. <laughs> Let's see what else I'm getting. Okay, universe, we have four cards spread. What's going to happen in Cancer Love Life? So there's obstacle and challenges, spiritual strength. Okay. Third Eye Chakra, High Princess, the Transformation card, which is the Death, um, I mean, the Tower, and Suffering Silence, Material, Spiritual, Prosperity, and then we have the Ace of Cups here, Love Begins. So I feel like what's going on is that the energy is changing, there's a shift. You guys don't care about the situation anymore. You guys are moving forward. You haven't clarity. You're not doing certain things that you probably used to do. Probably in the past, um, with access, you used to like, you know, really dwell on it. I feel like you're not doing that. You're moving forward. You are building this strong um, connection with yourself and with God, the universe. And I just see things are changing positively. Let's see what else I'm getting. random messages universe give me a four card spread what messages do you have for cancers so there's companion and seeker yep so it kind of reminds me of the rooming quote what you seek seeks you too i'm paraphrasing but <laughs> okay so yeah i feel like you guys are gonna be meeting someone who matches you someone who actually matches your fly someone who's very similar, okay? This could be someone that's in the same industry as you. You might meet them at work or a working event, okay? That's nice, that's good. Okay, let's look here. And if I see a four cards, by what's going to happen in Cancer's Love Five? So that is within the next few weeks. Helpful people, trust. Universe, give me one more card. Big happy changes. Meditation, bring answers and reconsider and get more information. Yeah, so I feel like someone, if you're completely single, someone is definitely interested in you. Um, okay, so I feel like it could be like a friend who's gonna tell you this, like a friend gonna be saying, oh, there's somebody who really wanna speak to you. Okay. Um, and this could be a co-worker as well who's gonna introduce you guys, okay? That's what I'm getting. But I feel like you guys are trusting in the universe, okay? You're not feeling horrible. I feel like you're feeling good about the decision that you're making and the way that you're moving, okay? And it's gonna lead to happy changes. Okay, let's look like here. Okay, 
Okay, universe, give me a two card spread. We must just see how for it. Cancers. So there is fearless self love. This is the master numbers. So some of you guys are fellow master numbers. Um, but this is about mastering a big lesson when it's like that. And then there's saving the positive, ages beauty. Okay, with grace, dignity, and strength, I grow into the, the unique texture of my feminine soul. And then there is whenever I choose to love myself, no matter the circumstances surrounding me, I'm practicing fearlessness. And then there's saving the positive. I allow myself the spaciousness of saving the delicious gifts in my life. Okay. So that's a reading that I have for you, Cancers. Thank you guys for watching my video and subscribing. If this video resonates, you can definitely book a person with me at Queen for the Tarot at gmail.com.